Hey everyone, happy Thursday. Today is February 13th. Welcome to today's update. Markets are down today. Well, except for the Russell. The Russell is holding on to some green, but looking at the S&P, the S&Ps were down quite a bit more and have since rallied quite a bit back up, which has been the theme lately. Other things going on, you see uh, oil's up a little bit, a natty gas is down a little bit, pretty mixed bag, gold is up slightly. So what did we do today? Well, we added an iron duck in SPX. So we've got a situation where we've got no risk to the upside. We'll make some money to the upside. And if it comes down into this area here, that's a big max profit area. And then we also closed out an iron duck in Tesla. So let's look at Tesla. Tesla rallied and we really had very little chance of getting down into our max profit area. And so we went ahead and just booked the, what we call a beak profit in that duck. As far as earnings go, we've got a couple of big ones. We've got NVIDIA after the bell and NVIDIA has been on fire. We did not place any alerts in NVIDIA, although there was a potential duck to be had. One that we did place was in Roku. So a similar situation where we've got profits as high as it goes, if it explodes to the upside, We've got a huge downside buffer all the way down to about 118. So anywhere in this area here would be max profit. So that's what we're looking for out of Roku. There's a couple other earnings that we didn't do a trade on, but Anet is announcing really high implied volatility. Um, so the, the options just aren't quite as liquid as we like to see. They're not bad. The bid asks were a little bit wide. If we look at the one day options, you can see the open interest is fine. Bid ask is just a little bit wide, but definitely tradable if you're interested in that one. So those are all the trades. Let's take a look at some of the other stocks here. Big movers, Baidu's down a couple percent. Beyond Meat's down a couple percent. Cisco, one of the bigger movers, announced earnings yesterday. Yeah, on the 12th, and it's down about 5%. CVS down a couple percent after their earnings. And those are all, oh yeah, NTAP after earnings down over 9%. And uh, Tesla, like I said, up 4% today. Yelp up three. So that is about it, my friends. Everybody have a great evening. Tomorrow we'll do our pro members weekly recap with all the current positions, all of the trade alerts for the week. Everybody have a good one and we'll talk to you next time.